all sports should be gender neutral. Yeah. In fact. All right, guys. So right here we have a friendly competition between a football player and a soccer player. Man versus woman. Stay tuned to see what happens, man. What's good, guys? Man, it's Jay Hall. And I'm back with some more BS I found on TikTok, man. I got more videos about this equality nonsense, man. You're trying to draw this equality curtain over us, but it doesn't work because that's not reality. Men and women are built different from the day we were born. See, we are built and treated differently. If I had a daughter and a son, I would treat them the same way too. I treat my daughter like a delicate princess. And I would treat my son like the strong masculine prince that he is. And guys, welcome back to another video by yours truly, Jay Hall, man. If you're new to this channel, we keep it real over here. We keep it based and we also try to find the truth. And follow me on Instagram, man, if you have any questions for me or if you just want to see my daily life, all right? I want equal pay because it's like, why am I going to college? I'm getting A's and B's and this nigga got C's. All right, let me, let, me, let, me, let, me, let me ask you Would you rather have a high profile job for no pay or clean sewers for $100,000 a year? I would clean sewers if it's more money. Okay. Do you think most women would choose to do that? Um, I don't know what, 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 what most women choose to do. I'm talking about me. Okay, no, I get that. But I'm saying I've interviewed hundreds of women and most women actually would not choose a dangerous, dirty job. Is that possibly why a lot of women get paid less? Why do we have the expression, that's a man's job? Because certain things are a man's job. Because it's like, why gotta take the trash out if there's a man in the house? Right, so I'm or just saying- lift heavy things. Well, is it, fair to, is it fair to say if you want equal privileges, you need equal responsibilities? No, I want, why is responsibility equal equality? Because you gotta I'm take- I'm just trying to get equal pay. Because you gotta take why the bad with the good. Why do I have all the extra shit if I can't- Why can't I just have equal pay? Don't you have to take the bad with the good? No, you do not. We should have equality, period. You see what I mean? You know what I mean? I have no- <laughs> I don't know what that means, and I don't, want, I don't want you to- She just contradicted herself all over the place, man. The grades you get in college doesn't necessarily equate to the amount of money you will make. And they just have this thing about putting everything back towards themselves. We're talking about the general population. Women aren't garbage men, aren't in the sewers. Majority of women do not work those jobs. So that contributes to the factors of why men are making more money overall, because they are choosing to do these jobs. Subscribe! I don't think that simping is a real thing. I think it's something that men have created to distance themselves from having any affection towards women y'all don't want women to have uh positive interactions with men categorize as simping because the woman is taking advantage of you y'all get on the internet every day and tell women how much y'all do not like women you'd rather hang out with your friends why would i give her money for her nails why would i do this that's simping that's that he's just a trick he's a simp she's defending simping because it benefits women they're getting money they're getting food they're getting all the attention from these guys that they will never give their attention back to women don't respect simps you think these only fans girls respect the guys that pay for their content no in their minds they're thinking why is this guy just giving me his money? I didn't do anything for him. I don't even talk to him. And their respect just drops for that guy. While they go suck off the chat or Tyrone for free, they don't even take her on dates. While you over here sending her hundreds and thousands of dollars to get a like on a comment. It's crazy. That's crazy, man. This is the kind of man a woman wants. Right there, what benefits do you get from having him as a friend? So the benefits that I get is like he can tell me like what guys are into me and what guys aren't. What benefits does he get from having you as a friend? All right, it's it's you. <laughs> it's different perspectives. You know what I mean? Every person is different. People are just people. If we like the same things, why can't we be friends? It doesn't matter who you are or what you are. If somebody tried to rob you right now, do you expect him to try and step in? Um, I feel like because he is my friend 100%. If he's going to risk his life for you, what do you think would be an equal benefit for him having you as a friend? I I don't even know how to answer the question right now because, like, I, 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 I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. Like I said, I, I don't look at it like that. I do for you what I would do for anybody. So for me, it makes no difference who it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
I don't get any benefit with being friends with her if I was friends with you. Right. Listen, man, men rarely benefit from having female friends, man, because they still expect boyfriend treatment, even though they're not giving you any vagina. So you have to be smart with these female friends. Make him invite you to other events where there are other girls. Make him be your wingman. If a girl is your friend and she doesn't want to be your wingman and she embarrasses you in front of other girls, drop her, bro. She is toxic. She's not even a friend. You can't even call her a friend. She's a sabotager. <laughs> She's damn your enemy. You know what I'm saying? She the op. All sports should be gender neutral. Yeah. The fact that they're separated perpetuates this idea that male and females are separate and the skill level is different. So men are stronger, so they have a separate sport, which is kind of a how is it bullshit? Men typically are more physically capable than women. If we were in the same league, the women would get destroyed. There would be no competition. Sports would be sports wouldn't be fun to watch. It's just like if the military held men and women to the same standards, a lot of women wouldn't be in the military. And here's an example of how stronger a man actually is than a woman. Check it out. could see the look in her eyes she was ready man she knows something bro she knows some kung fu some tai chi she knows some type of voodoo bro she was about to break his shit y'all have reserved self-love for ugly people because god forbid an actual attractive person realizes that they're attractive and posts about it and is confident y'all don't like that y'all want ugly people to love themselves because it doesn't intimidate you but god forbid a bitch who actually looks better than you knows that she looks better than you a lot of people are insecure man a lot of people don't love themselves. So whenever an attractive person kind of put themselves up, they're seen as like, oh, you're cocky, you're conceited, you're a narcissist. Women are out here getting BBLs, so the men are out here getting knee knee L's. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? There must be like some risk of them not walking or running the same anymore. Cause they're literally breaking their bones and putting it together like Yeah, I know man, I know. Subscribe! Um, like he kinda got mad that I like didn't text him when I got there, which that's very like weird to me. Like I used to text my parents when I was 16 when I got places. Like, well, I just think you, he like you, thought I, I was dead on the side of the road or she, something. She got kind of offended that I said, be careful when she laughed. Like, oh, have a good night. Be careful. <laughs> There's another instance. Um, she went to see some of her friends. She just told me she was doing it. He wanted me to ask permission. <laughs> is that what you feel? Love, love the word there. Yeah, permission. You feel, no. you feel, is that what you feel? Yeah, and I told him that. And he was like, no, I just wanted you to ask if it was okay. And I was like, that's the same thing. Right. Bro, honestly, where the hell are y'all finding these women? Damn. All, all it is is like, because again, that we're married. 
you are still thinking that you're just where you were before, like single, you can do whatever you want. All right, guys, so let's fast forward to the most unbelievable part of this video. Sometimes I like pass out on my guy friend's couch because like I don't like driving home and we've been up late and they're literally like, I mean, they might as well be my gay best friends. Like they're my best guy friends. Are they your gay best friends? I mean, they're not gay now. But... Okay. No, uh, I'm a married man. Yeah. yeah, That's not okay with me. It's not okay with me. Has nothing to do with me controlling my wife. From a guy's perspective, if my wife falls asleep on a guy's couch, I'm gonna be worried crazy. Yeah, a lot of women do not know how to be wives now. They think certain bad behaviors are acceptable. She's, she's a married woman sleeping on her friend's couch. Why are you sleeping on your friend's couch? And why are you getting mad that I'm calling you? I'm your husband. That should be common sense, bro. It's just nowadays, it's crazy. <laughs> It's crazy, man. And she has the nerve to justify her bullshit. So guys, make sure you get you a based girl. You know what I'm saying? A girl that actually wants to listen and not go off and talk to her toxic friends to justify her bad behaviors. All right, y'all. With that said, I'll see you on the next one, man. Stay up.